Okay, this is a review of Blue Ice book for partnering with the child and this is a self-identity through Ho'oponopono uh, Miss K.R. Sith Conversations um, book and basically there was a radio show with Miss K.R. and Dr. Hugh Lin and sometimes there would be different guests that appeared weekly um, one book sh shared that there were 62 radio shows, another book shared 100, but basically these books are a transcript of the radio shows. When I read the first book, I just only had the first book and access to just the first book on Amazon, and it pretty much had the same information that I've gotten uh, throughout the years from taking Dr. Hewlin's lectures with uh, Joe Vitale. And so when I read the first book, I did not recommend the first book because it was only 60 or so pages. This particular book, the count comes in at 123. And then of course, there are call outs on every other page. So this book comes in at about 60 pages as well. But the difference is Dr. Hugh Lin has information about blue solar water. Uh, he goes into great detail about how it helps him and his body feels better. It's like he's more flexible. And he pretty much said by drinking the blue solar water, it allowed his body to be more flexible and Ms. K go, K.R. goes into how to prepare the blue solar water. So there's a conversation about that. Um, there's another conversation about always cleaning, which I'm going to read to you. And um, there are other conversations in the book as well. So um, compared to that first book, yes. Definitely, I would recommend this book. If you are interested in Sith self-identity through Ho'oponopono, you might want to invest in the entire series. Um, I believe it's $152 for all eight books. If you get the series at once, you can sh save on shipping. I think the shipping was only $15 for the entire series. Whereas if you just get one book at a time, you pay $9.99 times eight for shipping. Also, um, what you need to keep in mind is if you like the books, these books are kind of small. Um, if you're familiar with the United States Post Office, if you get an envelope, all eight books will fit in the priority mail envelope. So also to keep in mind. So here's why I would recommend you get the book. Uh, I'm giving this book five out of five stars. Dr. Hewlin says, this is on page 77. The other cleaning tool that I want to share is the process of I love you. The two great laws of love are to one, love God, or to love that which has created you. And number two, to love your neighbors as yourself. By neighbors, I mean any memories that are replaying in you. The I love you process is another cleaning tool you can use before you eat, before you open the computer, before answering the telephone, or before doing anything. Saying I love you clears your mind or at least begins the process of clearing your mind. You can also say I love you whenever you end a particular activity like using the computer or eating or coming out of a movie theater or ending anything. The idea is to always clean, to always be cleaning. Another tool you can use is thank you. Every problem is really an opportunity and a blessing. When a problem comes up, instead of moaning and groaning and blaming somebody, you can say to that problem, within you so whatever problems are within you can say thank you every time you say thank you 
or I love you, the whole Ponopono process begins. Wow, that's so beautiful. And some of the contents, uh, just to look at the table of contents, is beginning at zero, training the Unihilipali. Unihilipali, I believe that's how you pronounce it. I'm sorry, please forgive me. Um, but training the inner child, basically, chapter three is how the cleaning tools work. Chapter four, memories are inside of me. Chapter five, using the cleaning tools. Chapter six, cleaning ahead. And chapter seven, partnering with the child. And then um, there's always an editor's preface, an author introduction. And then in the appendix, there's usually who's in charge, bibliography, contributor notes, online resources, another bibliography, and the index of cleaning tools. Okay, so that's it for this book. Uh, I think we have about four more books to go, and I look forward to sharing those with you. Talk to you later. Bye.